Well, it was a scathing report saying police in Uvalde, Texas showed egregious poor decision making during the school shooting that killed 19 students and two teachers. Now Metro police are letting Metro school principals know they're ready in case the worst happens. Thanks everyone. I'm Rory Johnston and I'm Carrie Sharp at an in service training today. Metro Police Chief John Drake told teachers in the case of a school shooting, his officers will not hesitate to enter a school and stop a shooter. News Channel 5's Jason Lamb spoke with a Metro school principal who heard the chief's remarks. It doesn't take long talking to Eakin Elementary Principal Eric Hartfelder to tell he loves his students. I tell everybody who listen that we are essentially Nashville in a building. Uh, we are diverse in the ways that we are diverse. But behind his focus to help kids learn is to first keep them safe from nightmares like the Uvalde school shooting. Shots fired! Get inside! And I think, um, how do we make sure that that never happens here? Nobody should ever have to experience that. This week, a Texas investigative committee outlined what it called systemic failures and egregious poor decision making from police who delayed confronting the Uvalde gunman for more than an hour. So when Metro schools held a safety and security meeting today, the same one it holds every year, Eric could tell this one felt different. The environment in the room, the importance was palpable. Uh, you could tell that this is something that even more than ever, we have to make sure that we are getting right. And this year, Eric shared the room with Metro Police Chief John Drake, visiting to tell him and 100 other Metro Elementary School administrators, if the worst ever happens in Nashville, we're going in. And hearing him say, we're going in, that's, I can tell you that's, that's what I wanted to hear, uh, both as a Metro parent uh, and also as you know, principal. Um, and I know I'm not alone in that. So his presence was incredibly helpful. A sense of togetherness and a shared mission that Eric says he and others got loud and clear. Preparation for something everyone in this room hopes they never have to face. It was like this little rallying cry, like we got this. We're all in this together and we're going to we're going to take care of it because every single child in our city deserves it. Jason Lamb, News Channel 5.